Can you explain what all of this is right here? Okay, so so this is a pump off controller is what we're looking at. A pump off. What's what's actually pumping off here? So a pump off controller is what's controlling a pumping unit, right? The a lot of people are familiar seeing these 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 pumping units. Uh, they got different names. Uh, Nodding donkey. Uh, I've heard grasshopper, right? But you know what I'm talking. You see them on movies, right? The, these it, it's a and it's it's on an oil well, and that pumping unit is connected to sucker rods, right? <clears throat> and those sucker rods go anywhere from you know 2,000, 3,000, 5,000, 8,000, 12,000 feet into the earth and they hook onto a pump, right? And what we're doing is a pump out controller is, is monitoring the efficiency of that entire pumping unit system. And the point of the, a pump off controller if I'm doing 100% of the work at surface, right? I'm going up and down, I'm lifting all these loads all day, every day. If the pump isn't filling up, I don't wanna be doing all the work. So I'm gonna maximize my efficiency. I'm gonna slow down, or maybe I'm gonna turn off and let that fluid come back into the well bore, and then I'm gonna kick on again when the pump is full. So when you're driving by and you see these pumping and it's not moving, it's not because we're just wasting, uh, we're inefficient or we, it's something tied to oil prices. It's not, it's, it's these it systems. Yeah, they could be broken, right? But uh, a lot of times these things are slowing down and turning off based off the pump fillage that's happening 8,000 feet beneath your, beneath surface.